Hello, this is Taylor Elwood, your business wizard for eccentric entrepreneurs at ImagineYourReality.com. And today I want to talk a bit about um, the importance of experimenting with your marketing. I recently wrote an article about five ways you could experiment with your marketing, and you can find the link to that below in the video. But I wanted to share with you an example of an experiment that I did um, very recently, really just this week. I've been taking this list building summit, and uh, which is all about building your email list and one of the speakers spoke about the fact that he actually goes and sends out an email every day and I thought to myself at the time an email every day that seems ridiculous and over the top but as I got to thinking about it further I realized you know maybe it's not what if what if sending an email a day actually does work and so I thought you know what I'm gonna try a little experiment this week and see what happens and so I decided to send out an email every day this week. And I'm not sure if I'm going to commit to this to the long term. But what I found interesting is that, yes, I did get some unsubscribes from my newsletter. I kind of, I, I expected that. But what I also got is I got more people actually emailing me and talking to me than I had ever had before. You know, I had, I, I, I think I've gotten at least one email a day each day from other people responding to my emails. And I thought that was really cool because that's not normally happened to me. So it, it said something to me about the fact that people were doing that. Now, I think that if I proceed with this kind of process that I'm going to want to tweak it a bit. In fact, there's going to be a lot of tweakage happening um, with my email marketing uh, as a result of the List Building Summit. But it really brought home the fact that I actually got something of value from the experience by trying to do something different. Sometimes we get so tunnel vision about how we market our business that we don't see the ways that that, it's in, that, that marketing isn't helping us. Uh, we just know something's wrong. And sometimes the only way you can discover what's wrong is to actually just go do something different. Like in my case, I realized that really part of my issue with my own newsletter is that I'm not getting, I'm not necessarily getting as many reads as I want. And that bothered me. That's one of the reasons I took the list building summit, because it's like, hey, I want people to open this up. I want people to actually care about the content that I'm sharing, because I'm spending my time writing it. And what I realized from that is that, you know, part of the problem is that I wasn't necessarily being as personal and intimate as I could be. And that's what people want. They want a personal, intimate connection. I know that. I've told people that before. So why wasn't I following my own advice? Well, hey, we get caught up in these blinders. And so sometimes the only way to remove the blinders is to do something totally different. So here's what I would really urge for you is to take a look at your own marketing and ask yourself what you're doing that's the same old, same old. What are the results? If you're not satisfied with the results, what could you do that's different? Try something radically different. Take a chance. Do something that you wouldn't expect to do. Recognize as well that what you're doing is, is you know, that, that what you're doing might involve an investment. Um, you know, business doesn't grow um, automatically. You, you've got to be willing to do the work, and sometimes that means uh, an investment as well as anything else. So just keep that in mind. Most importantly, don't give up on your marketing. Don't give up on trying to reach out and connect to people. I connected to people this week that I haven't connected to in a while, and that, that makes me happy. It means something special to me that people were willing to connect. All right, so thank you for uh, watching, and I look forward to connecting with you even more in the near future. Uh, if you have a comment, feel free to leave it below, and uh, make sure you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. You can click on the little dragon icon there. Thanks so much, and have a great day.